Hey guys, this ain't uh, this ain't today's review. Today's review is coming a lot later, and it's the big boy. I'm round. I've rounded up my Nightmare on Elm Street collection and my Friday the 13th. So I'm gonna be doing the remasters of both for Halloween on the 33 days of Scream because it starts on the 31st September and ends on the 1st of November. <coughs> Bless me. So that. Like so that. Like but Wes Craven's A New Nightmare came out in 1994. Fancy mystery film. It's an hour and 54 minutes long. Uh, didn't like it. Did not like it. This is the only franchise to never get a 10 out of 10. Like a main, big franchise. But let's get into them. We see Human Freddy create finger glove before he cuts his hand off. It's a film set. Then we see Heather, uh, his hus hu her husband, and her son. Son is named Dylan. Alone starts to uh, the glove starts to move and he kills one of the crew two cr cr crew workers, and it's a dr <coughs> and it's a dream. They wake up to an earthquake. They they then I skipped a bit, but baby uh, Heather has to head off to. Uh, uh, Nightmare on Elm Street 10 year anniversary thing uh, They got babysitter And then she heads off to this 10 year thing Robert England comes out as Freddy Krueger the, the dad dies you In car crash Kid Park meeting with Rob Robert England Boring act 2 Then Nancy breaks into hospital Babysitter is with Dylan in hospital. She can't see. The babysitter knocks Nurse out because she put Dylan to sleep. Babysitter is then killed by Freddy when she doesn't know he's there. But Jason, uh, as Dylan's asleep, he sees him shank her and kills her to death. Like Tina from the first one where she was dragged up the wall. That's, and then I couldn't, I couldn't be asked to watch any more of this shit. So I gave it a 5 out of 10. No, 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 no I'm sure it would turn... Um, because it was a different, it was a different film, a different fran different film in the, this franchise, which I really do appreciate when films try to do something new, so I gave it two points for that. The third point came from the kills. I thought the kills were amazing in this film, but oh, it's like Freddy's death, so that was an extra two points. Then the other point was the storyline is <laughs> subpar, so I gave it a 0 0.5 for that. And then I liked Dylan a lot as a character. We didn't know he existed, and yeah, and the return of Heather, and the return of Robert England, uh, and we think it's Robert Eng like a murder mystery type film, um, because you think it's Robert, but then you find out it's not Robert, and it's actually the entity of Freddy, which we really did like, so we'll give it a 5 out of 10, let me just make sure, 5 out of 10 is our official, oh fuck, I haven't even read it here, bye bye.